time for a new order. He's going to come home here and win the Totesport Cheltenham Gold Cup for our friends in the north, Nigel Twiston Davis and Paddy Brennan. Hello and uh, welcome to the Betfair Cheltenham preview. With that cinematic sort of opening, I'm tempted to use an, an advert line. If Betfair did Cheltenham previews, they would probably be the best Cheltenham previews in the world. And this is rather swanky, so you're in, you're in a very good spot indeed. Welcome along. Um, I'm going to introduce our panel to you. We're going to run through the the feature races for the first couple of days, then we're going to eat and drink and be merry and come back and run through uh, the main races of the second, uh, the third and fourth days of the festival. Let me introduce our panel, first of all. I'll go from your right to left, a man who obviously needs no introduction, but we'll give him one anyway. The living legend that is Mr. Paul Nichols is here with us. Welcome. Immediately to my left, uh, representing the finest brains of the Timeform brand, Mr. Kieran Packman. <laughs> Immediately to my right, I was going to think of a, a, a suitable introduction. One thing I would say is that Paul might get to go into the winner's enclosure a lot at Cheltenham. Ruby might get to go in a lot. We hope people like Mullins and Henderson might get to go into the winner's enclosure at Cheltenham a lot. This man went into the winner's enclosure at the Cheltenham Festival last year not four times or five times or six times, but ten times, having purchased ten of the winners at the Cheltenham Festival last year. I think it was probably a similar number the year before. The man has bought some of the finest bloodstock that's ever looked through a bridle. Mr. Anthony Bromley is with us. <laughs> Couch. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Mark Wynn Stanley is with us. You're lucky, you don't really need an introduction and you will introduce us to every aspect of your life, some of them unwelcome, later on <laughs> as we go through the evening, I'm sure. I, I'm lucky enough to work with the voice of Ireland, as we call him, Mr Gary O'Brien. Today we have the eyes and ears of Ireland, the Racing Post. Johnny Ward is with us to give us the Irish angle. Um, on that little bit of um, preamble, it did say no talking, switch your phones off and stuff like that. We do want you to talk, actually. If you've got any points you want to raise and you want to pick some of these amazing brains at any point, try and catch my attention, raise your hand. Tony Calvin, uh, who's well known to many of you, I'm sure, is at the back of the room. Looks like he's on the door, but actually <laughs> he's, got, he's got a microphone with him and uh, he will come round and take any questions and we will um, hear from you, I hope, during the course of the evening as well. Don't go home thinking, I wish I, wish I had asked Paul Nichols X or Y, you can ask.